In today's part three of our four part Fiery Friday series titled Fiery Automation Tools, I'm gonna to show you how easy it is to create a Fiery Imposition template using Fiery Impose, then add that imposition template to your job presets or Fiery Hot Folder workflows. Let me show you how this works. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a job inside a command workstation, it's a business card, and we're gonna open up Fiery Impose. With Fiery Impose open, we're going to now lay out the imposition template. So we're gonna come over here to Gang Up, then Repeat. We'll make our finish size user defined, so it will be a business card size. We'll select our sheet at 12 by 18. I'll throw this to portrait mode so it's easier to see. And then we're gonna make this an eight over three or a 24 up layout for my business cards. We'll then add a gutter of an eighth inch around and apply that to all the slots. And then finally, we'll add some trim marks so we know where to cut this. Then we'll come up here and save the template as 24 up BC. And now we have a imposition template created for business cards. That's part one. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to come over here to the three dots and go to device center of that Fiery. Inside of device center, we'll go to job presets and we'll select new. And we're going to name this 24 up BC. And then we'll come here and define. And this will open up our job properties where we can set up our settings for this particular workflow. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to our media tab and we're going to make sure that we're always printing this on 16.12 by 18. Then we're going to go to layout and underneath layout we're going to select impose. Underneath here you're going to notice that now the 24 up BC template is available for us to add to a workflow. So if we hit OK and OK again we have now created a workflow with the Fiery Impose template. And if we do a right click on the job you'll notice underneath Apply workflow, we have the 24 up BC available. So if we select that and process and hold the job, that imposition template will be applied. Now let me show you how you do that with a hot folder. So what we'll do is we'll open up our hot folders tool. We'll select new. Again, we'll name this 24 up BC. We will select the fiery that it's assigned to. We'll then go to our job action. We'll make this a process and hold so we can run it. We'll go to our job properties and you'll see underneath here 24 up BC is available. We'll select that as well. Then finally we'll hit OK and now we have a new hot folder created. So let's take that job, same job that's on our desktop and download it to our new 24 up business card workflow and we'll come back here to command workstation and in a second you will see the finished results. So here you can see the business card that was a one-up has now been laid out using the imposition template we created and applying it to a hot folder workflow. So that's how easy it is to automate imposition templates in the various workflows in your Fiery.